Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog again. This is me, Dexter, and this is week 4, day 7 of the vlog. Of the challenge, I mean. This is, um, well, why am I keep saying this is, uh, day 7? It's the October 8th, if I would say. Let me check again. Yeah, 8th of October. I've done this challenge four weeks ago. I'm being consistent, which is hard to do. Um, and I've been doing a set of routine and plan. So far, we've finished, well, semi-finished one goal of, for the year, which is buying gym equipment. And why because i didn't want to go to the gym which is cost me 26 dollars per week it's too expensive and as well as fuel i don't want to waste fuel so it's far like seven minute drive so i bought a gym equipment a bench with a leg curl and leg extension attachment and dumbbells yeah um i've done my routine stretch stretching check emails although i didn't eat because i'm trying to lose my belly fat i'm getting big in the belly section so i'm gonna do fasting which is very very hard um, maybe two or one meal a day if we're pushing it like one meal but if I'm really hungry I'll take a half of two meals yeah um, anyways I gone to work work is very chill and very hot because there's a bushfire near our town I reckon it's like 100 kilometers from our town it's very humid the weather is very humid and every time there's a bush i think my body just completely getting sick i don't like it but you know life must go on um and get on with it i'm a man so i have to you know suck it up and then do do something that really not you know make what am i saying like get on with it don't mind it i'm a man so who cares nobody cares um and then went home took a nap did listen to some opm songs shout out to those people who makes opm song back home um what else? I also... I also eat, well, dinner, which is the one I cooked last night, pastel. Um, and finish a... this prime bottle, which is orange, tastes nice compared to bubblegum. Bubblegum is overhyped. Uh, then I read books, which is Art of War by Sancho. I'm rereading it, and there's a um saying that if you know your enemy, know yourself, you will will win every battle, and in every war, there's always direct and indirect method which coexist together and making a never ending maneuvers methods if you mix them together indirect and direct and a disciplined man will conquer everything will change fear into courage and weakness into strength And what else? 
uh, and it brings like loyalty a disciplined man um, I'm like let's say one quarter of the book already this is why I don't want to read it like intensively because as soon as I read it like just like that I will finish it within a day as so I'm taking my time reading the books and yeah that's it I can't remember some of the things that said in the book but it it is a very very knowledgeable and very informative book about planning strategy war uh, about life maybe but it is helpful to me I reckon you guys should read it too to open your mind and blow your mind up <laughs> not literal but in a you know sensible way um overall today work is not was not busy chill very hot overall together could have done better well, I'm not maybe I'm not disciplined enough I'm not trained I'm not I don't train my brain enough to be disciplined and um, consistent maybe maybe that's the reason um, hmm today was a bit well it's productive if I would say and sort of not really productive because uh, all I did all I did was nap and then eat then read books it's like very repetitive I want to do something new hmm. just comment something like any recommendation down in the comment section I will do it and like speaking to my missus getting her criticism and you know makes my day complete which is now I'm doing filming uh, videoing myself videoing my progress and yeah that's it I hope you enjoyed this video even though it's not really informative and not entertaining this is me my me and my challenge and the progress I'm just filming my progress technically I'm not really entertaining but you can see for yourself if the result is showing but I don't know myself so if the result is showing you would be the judge thank you for watching I hope you get I hope you inspired doing the same thing as me I hope the video bids you well and hope that you're having a great day and keep striving for greatness always give yourself a hundred percent to something that you're doing and take life as it is do not live in the future nor in the past just live in the present man you get through this i know you can and this is day seven of week four coming into week five tomorrow day one hopefully everything will be interesting see you tomorrow and goodbye